Hello everyone. Welcome to my Oracle Certification Guideline Series. So in this series, I'll be giving various suggestions, guidelines about how to pass Oracle Fusion Cloud certifications. Also, I'll be sharing some sample exam question papers. So please take this opportunity to prepare well for the exam. Having said that, don't forget that there is no substitute of working hard and going through the, all the concepts related to the subject and practicing well in the demo instance. However, these guidelines will give you an extra boost to crack the exams easily. So starting with the first one, so this video is all about Oracle Fusion Cloud GL certification. The code is 180960. So before exam, I would recommend you review the exam syllabus which will be available in the Oracle website and try to fo focus more on the topics listed in the syllabus. Link is given in the description for your quick reference. And while preparing for the exam, please go through the concepts very well. Revise as many times as you can. Also, practice in the demo instance with examples. And if you can afford, I would recommend you please attend Oracle Fusion trainings. And of, of course, please subscribe my video channel and keep watching my all the video which I will be publishing as part of this series. So this will give you a good understanding of the question patterns. And please continue to post comments in my videos so that I can clarify your questions if you have any. During exam, so I hope you will be scheduling the exam based on your uh, preparation. So while attending the exam, please remember some of the key points here. Total there will be 76 questions for GL for this particular certification exam. However, these 76 questions include some non-scoring questions as well. Like even if you answer correctly for those exams, you won't get any score for that. And obviously, if you answer incorrectly, there won't be any impact for your scoring. So total time for this exam, 2 hours, 126 minutes. You won't be allowed to carry anything inside the exam center. There will be one erasable board and pen which you can use for your RAP work. To pass this exam, you need to score 60%. So approximately if you correct 60 questions, there will be high chance of passing the exam. If you score less or if you are not confident about the 60 questions, bare minimum, then there will be a chances that you may fail because there will be quite a lot of non-scoring questions will be included in this exam. And the question patterns will be multiple choice type. And last but not the least, please careful while using the system or the computer. Don't accidentally hit any power button or uh, electrical switch point. Because if the system shuts down I mean, unexpectedly, then your 
exam score will be marked as failed. So please take extra care while using the system. Let's run through the questions. There will be 10 questions in the remaining video. So please go through them. At the end, the answers will be displayed. So please match with them and see how many of them you manage to answer correctly.
here are the answers for the previous questions please match with your answers and see how many of them you answer correctly That's all for now. Hope all of you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to watch my next video where I'll be coming up with 10 more questions on this GL certification exam. Till then, goodbye. Thank you.